Hello and welcome to Body Fox Gaming. If you are new to the channel, subscribe for more World of Warcraft videos. First, I would like to wish you the very best in the new year. In this video, I will show you the new mounts coming in the next patch. This patch is coming on January 14 for the US realms and January 15 for the EU realms. Raid will be open one week later. First mount I'm going to show you is Caravan Hyena. This is Horde only mount and you will get this mount after you are done with Vulpira achievement. In order to start this quest line, you need to go to Orgimar Embassy. First you have to complete Voldunai and Secrets in the Sands achievement. I made few guides for the Vulpira. There will be a link in the description. Cool walking mount. Waste Wonder Sky Terror. You can buy in Udum. You need to be exalted with this new faction. Price is 24,000 gold. I will be buying this mount. Looks good. Waste Marauder. You will drop from a rod faster in Udum. When Udum is under the attack from the old gods, this rare mob will appear and after you kill it, you will have a chance to get this mount. Shadow Barb Drone from the quest ready to fly. When Udum is under the attack from the old gods, you can find the egg and click on it in Ankanet Harbor, southwestern part. It looks like it will be a long quest line, between 20 and 30 days, I am not sure, it's still on PTR, so I suggest you start it as soon as possible. During this quest line, you will get a toy and one pet. Cool looking mount, definitely unique. Melvo and Drone, you will drop from a corpse eater in Udum. Wicked Swarmer, you will have to buy from Ration in Chamber of Heart for 100,000 corrupted mementos. You will get these for completing daily quests, world quests, and assaults in Udum and Vale of Eternal Blossoms. Spring for Alpaca from the quest Alpaca it in Zone Odum. I was not able to find this quest in the Valhead database. It looks like it's connected to a herb Gershaw Greens and you have to feed Alpaca with that herb. How long will that last? I'm not sure. Or even is this Alpaca available during all the times or maybe only during assault? Definitely cool looking mount. Drake of the Four Winds will drop in Odum. Ivory Cloud Serpent, Veil of Eternal Blossoms. Will this be a rare or maybe something like Alani? in the midst of Pandaria, I'm not sure. Definitely cool looking mount. Rajani Boar Serpent, you can buy in Veil of Eternal Blossoms, Vendor is Zenku, for only one. Pristine Cloud Serpent Scales, don't have the slightest idea on how to obtain this item. Clutch of Hawi will drop from Hawi in Veil of Eternal Blossoms. It uses the same model as Clutch of G Kun from the Throne of Thunder Raid. Uncorrupted Void Wing. This mount looks awesome. 
For me, the best walking mount in this patch. I'm reading the comments on the vow head and it looks like this will be a reward for the ahead of the curve now water raid. Ran stalwart hound, it will drop from the hound world ran, rare enemy in the veil of eternal blossoms. Xinval, one more recall of this mount, will drop from Undead Oil. So far I did not have any of these hounds and now I'll have two. Vicious White Bone Steed, what to say, this PvP mount looks awesome. It's a reward in Battle for Azure Season 4. Grass to PvP players, really looks great. Vicious White War Saber is the Alliance reward for Battle for Azure Season 4. Mechagon Mechano Strider is a reward for LI race Mechagnomes. Nyalota O Seer dropped from Enzod the Corruptor on a mythic difficulty. That's a lot of eyes, and I'm starting to feel dizzy just by looking at him. A Lucy Quick Hoof Zone Modoon. Looks like you have to feed this quick hoof with the seaside leafy green sminx and you can buy this food at all vendors. And that is all the information I was able to find on this mount. Where is the quick hoof? I don't know. Molly will draw from Dune Gorger Crowlock. That's the real boss in the Vodun, whom you are no longer killing. When the 8.3 hits and he spawns, I'll have to go again and kill him on my 6 max level characters. Awakened Mindborn, achievement bet for Azeroth Keystone Master Season 4. In order to get this mount, you need to complete all bet for Azeroth dungeons and mythic level 15 or higher within the time limit. Of course, this includes the new dungeons, upper and lower mechagon. Male mantra from the horrific visions. Right now I'm not sure how we will get this mount. Maybe it will be something like army training in the Surmar with the Watian fox, that would be great. Black Serpent of Enzot through the depths of vision. You have to do four achievements for this one. The most horrific visions of Stormwind, the most horrific visions of Orgrimmar, Unwavering Resolve, and we have the technology. And the last Worm Mount is Wriggling Parasite for the glory of the Nihilator Raider. To be honest with you, I'm not a fan of this model of mount. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment, like and subscribe. When the patch hits, I'll be going for those alpaca mounts. Something new in the game. My favorite mount is that for ahead of the curve for the next raid. That rake looks awesome. Until next time, goodbye.